I'm back with another video. Today we have the real humiliation ritual that literally no one cares about. It's on both screens. Without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Stop using black women for your terrible, terrible videos. Am I happy with who I am? Am I happy with who I am? Am I happy with the people around me? The funny thing I'll see being tossed around is anytime a black man exhibits any form of femininity or anything that isn't overtly masculine. In the comments, boom, humiliation ritual, humiliation ritual. You were pink in a photo shoot, boom, humiliation ritual. You do some weird and funny and somewhat flamboyant pose, humiliation ritual. You take a weird, uh, not normal selfie with like white ash on your face. Hold on, we can't skip you. We cannot skip you. Meek meal. The meek shall inherit the earth somebody lied it's biblical but somebody lied what it looked like somebody went upside your, your shit what what paul bearers earn with his ashes on you 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 did this you somewhere bunny hopping for color for colonizers for capitalists and then you punch in a bag like a like a motherfucker that just learned how to walk but just with the arms like you you ain't even learn how to punch like what else then you at wwe rocky on the ground looking like the pebble right now you over there like get up i can't even do that like it's a meme somebody got that as an alarm it's get up get up it I used to have, what do you say, dreams like something. I how that song go? Cuffs locked on wrist. I can't look at you. I distinguish that you, you and a song is separable. You know, like the 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 bubble we used to draw in school. And then it's the middle part. Like I distinguish the two. They separate. They not the same. You didn't make that song to me, basically. Cause this is crazy. Be trying to cover for this man. I, I can't. Same thing for Cole. He the, the grippy song. Grippy trash. You capable of making some trash like that? You not capable of being in my top nothing. But let's continue. We had to get to you, Meek. It's crazy. I seen you throwing punches like this. Like you need a. You need to get some. Grown ass man, if you have a confrontation and you ain't got your blicky and your security, it's up for you. Let's continue. A not normal selfie with like white ash on your face. Humiliation ritual. Black people around the black men will be really quick on calling something a humiliation ritual out of fear of protecting their masculinity. We already got a confirmed humiliation ritual though, and it's for black women. Stop being a fat. I don't know if y'all have noticed the overabundance of content made at the expense of black women, but it's a thing that's been happening for years now. Whether if it's in the streamer space, or if it's in a damn 20v1 Atlanta uh, crash out city space, or if it's on shitty alpha male podcasts where they say nothing smart and insightful at all and only have the energy for women uh, and never cis men, ever. Black women are always the butt of the joke. And the sad part is it's on them. I'm not blaming these women for being disrespected at all. Obviously, they could just not disrespect them, but they can also just not occupy these spaces where they routinely are being treated as a joke where they probably think that they are a part of the joke and not just the joke every time i see one of these like 20v1 videos i just think like what possessed you to even get on here what made you think you'd be respected on a platform where you get some dealers rapper to tell you to do a 360 and clap it three times only to tell you to go left nigga swipe left like it's tender on my face nigga is that his kid she talking about how long guy whatever your name is buddy i'm here to tell you black females these females they don't give a fuck about what you're talking about to them you will be considered the lame they what a lit niggas at hot girl son that's what they on they don't give a fuck about what you're talking about it's like you trying to you need to walk in your divine feminine electron energy goddess mother of you you can do that dr umar shit all you want you can buy don't be promiscuous for the following reasons they like boy fuck you that that's that's what it is they don't care they want to be around the lit niggas they want some of that clout they want to inglace it's gonna be what it's gonna be me personally i don't have a problem with it get up here on the 20 v1s 
Ain't a one V. What do you say? One V twenty twenty V one if I gotta smack niggas that right with you. <laughs> nah. When I see that, it just reaffirmed what I already know. I'm not choosing anything of the United States of America. You just keep showing. So I, I like when they I like when they do that. Just reaffirm what I already know. I, I ain't got no problem with it. To me, that ain't got shit to do with me. Look at me. Look at me. Fuck on me. Look at me. Like I'm literally copper or gold. The top of this is black. I'm closer to this a gold before I am black. I'm gold. I'm starting a new thing for sure. I ain't gotta be what you say I am. Black is void of life. Void black is void of color, is death. Black Laws Dictionary. Once more, you're throwing yourself underneath the bus in a jujitsu system. Identifying as black. And I'm truly not black, even if it didn't go against if it didn't go against you and a jujitsu system. I still am not black. And even hold on. Hold on. Alright, but even the the creativity, the things I can do is very alive and colorful. The rainbow, the seven colors and the chakras, the spectrum. And they try to associate that with some low vibrational unnatural weird shit. It ain't got nothing to do with that. The rainbow is real. It's been here before them people in them groups. But um Yeah. Y'all can be black if y'all want to. I ain't a part of that. I don't agree with George Soros and the Black Lives Matter movement. I don't give a fuck about that movement. That movement don't got nothing to do with me. But let's continue. They black. I'm not black. I'm gold. Long he gonna last in bed next to a fucking child. Am I tripping somebody? Let me know. Have some decorum and take that Selena shirt off. Why are we like this? I know we ain't a monolith, but we are the ones who do this shit. 50 women versus two YouTubers. This thumbnail will get me demonetized. You probably need to get picked and you got your hands on your ankle. See, I like when they like this. I know I ain't fucking with none of them. Not on no... On that tip, nah, not at all. So yeah, I like when they show, I like when the thought show themselves and make themselves, I like that. So I know, even though I already know it's other ways I can identify, I can just scan your bio field until, but yeah, I ain't, I ain't got no problem with it. Let's continue. Put hands on your ankles. 20 women versus Lil Duvall. Don't ever look up what he said about Justin Bieber and his daughter. 20 women versus two rock stars and his fucking Ayo and Tao. You shaking the goodies for Rolly Rolly and a dab of ranch? Nigga, that's a Fortnite emo. Listen, this is pretty lame, but at least you're on, on a live stream in a room full of dirty ass niggas being watched by prepubescent dirty ass niggas all calling you ugly on a slick. Haha, -ha, she looks like a man because she's dark skinned. Nigga, check the bottom of your sock. What are you talking? about niggas get money and dreads and forget how they look you look like a neutral rat are you stop friendly reminder that transphobia affects everyone this is a clear-cut example of that they must have paid her because there's no way in hell all that for a drop of clout still at least you're going on a platform where guys probably will like you or the guys watching probably will like you these black women who go on these alpha male podcasts to get ridiculed and talk down dumb to for the life of me i couldn't understand you're gonna let mr ball with a hair transplant talk to you crazy mr black woman never loved me so now i have to project my misogynoir on to unsuspect the Instagram models and college students we paid to be on our show so we can get surface level debate bro gotchas on. This nigga look like when a manga could draw as a black person for the first time. You look like a stock image. This is proof that you can be buff and still scare the hoes. Do you think that he thinks he's doing a service? That he's having meaningful debates and discussions with people? He can't even control his own show and he actually gets a girl with a backbone on. You invite women who probably think they're going to be engaging in a meaningful conversation and ask them a bunch of bullshit loaded questions that lock them into these holes that make them feel stupid. And it gives me secondhand embarrassment every time I see it. Why? Why do you bring yourself to these spaces where you know you aren't respected? The clout can't be that good. Unless your sex woman is probably oh awesome. A lot of niggas are secretly yeah. yeah. That are gay and they don't know how to handle that. This is a literal humiliation ritual. We don't need any conspiratorial nonsense to see this. This is very blatant uh, in front of everybody and nobody really seems to care. Or the people that do seem to be outweighed by the people who don't. The black femmes in my life don't play that shit. I don't know why y'all do. Look, whatever incel clout you get ain't worth it. Stop it. Fresh and fit, nigga. If I ever saw you in real life, I'm licking my thumb. Grabbing your head, and I'm gonna nook you them enhancements off your shit. We're gonna see just how much of that's real. Oh, also, it's my birthday. So, uh, tell me happy birthday. See you at MomoCon.
mind get your shotting gun. Did this man earlier just call niggas ugly and dirty? My boy, if this you, you look like you fit in that room with him. Honestly speaking. You ugly as hell too. That mean your parents weren't making love. That mean they were bumping uglies and you the product of that. Cause I sure enough was gonna ask you talking about fellas. Is you, is you bold enough to show yourself? You ugly as hell. The video was entertaining though. He see he said them niggas emotes was was from Fortnite, and they did it first. That's crazy. That's it for this video. Don't forget to like the video if you like the video. Hell, comment, share, subscribe, turn on post notifications. DM me the link via X, formerly known as Twitter. Let me know what you want me to react to next or what you want me to talk about. Follow me on Twitch, Kick, and Rumble. Before we start rumbling, I kick your ass and you end up twitching. Us versus them, man. I'll see y'all in the next video. I'm out.